Hi YouTube friends, Brad of Silver Lining Daydreams. In today's video, we're gonna show you how to remove an RV stove. Be sure first to shut off the gas or propane and the power before starting to work on and remove your RV stove or an RV stove top for that matter. We also opened some windows just in case there was a little residual gas left in the line. Here's the stove parts. Basically, this there's four holes. It's just pulled right out. All right, so let's see here. What we have here. This just lifts off. There's a tab here and a tab here, and just kind of sits on there. So yeah. Actually, before I take out the other two screws, I'm thinking I should unhook it where the gas comes into the stove. There we go. I don't smell any gas. Um, one of the techs out here that works here where I store my RV told me that I might smell a little bit bleeding out and just might take a few minutes for it to disappear. All right, let's get those other two screws here. Kind of doing this awkwardly so you can see what I'm doing. So this is everything disconnected. You can see that there's food in there. And I don't know if all these washers fell off when I took it apart or what the deal is there. So I gotta figure out what to do with those when I put it back together. All right, let's try to pull this out. I'm not sure where to grab it. Parts of it are fragile. As far as I know, it's just those four screws. I think this is part of the hinge. All right, I'm thinking it pulls straight out because of this uh, copper tube for the gas. Does it lift? So there's a screw on the bottom left and right hand corner. I don't know if you can see this, but I need to take these screws out. All right, so let's try to get this puppy out. Let's see what happens here. The copper gas line, the stove needs to kind of come straight out because of the pipe for the gas in the hole. Trying to grab it with their structure. Now I know some of these might be grounded. So let's get a look back there. I don't see anything. Oh gosh, where do I grab it? Okay, the pipe for the gas went all the way through. Let's just make sure I don't see anything because I don't want anything to break. And I'm not strong like I used to be. All right, maybe I was never strong. There we go. Oh my goodness, where is it gonna fit? This is a problem. All right, we got this puppy out, so um, yeah, let's get the rest of this counter out now. I think we'll stop here, so be sure to like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss out on our next RV rental video as we're gonna be renovating this whole kitchen area. And as always, thanks for watching.